Okay, Taurus, you guys are next for a quick little love read. Um, if you like the channel, absolutely like, subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified whenever I upload another video. Um, levitation, higher ground, belief, mastery, and medi meditation. Mantra, medicine, command, song, incantation, and containment. Okay. Um, if you're interested in personal read, the information is in the description box down below. And this is going to be a quick little love read. So let's get into your energy. I'm using three new Oracle card decks and they're working out with each three. I'm telling you, they work together. They flow beautifully. Pure magic Oracle card deck, dream Oracle card deck, using a card tarot, and then the hidden truth Oracle card deck at the end. So that's right. Great creator, Father God, divine mother, mother Mary, angels, ancestors, and spirit guides. I just pray and ask for wisdom, clarity, and protection. For any messages need to come through for the collective son of Taurus for this their quick little love read. Jesus' name, amen. I feel like you've been doing that a lot. Having to take a breath rather than kill people. Not even kill people, just like go off on them. Cali swords, like it's that type of thing. Like just taking a minute. <sighs> like getting aggravated. There's an aggravation. Is this relationships? Love? This is love. Oh. Okay. Honey, if you have to be like that, just kind of look at your relationship again. All right, here we go. Two, uh, one off the top, one off the bottom. I'm just going to say two off the top. Let's take two off the top then. Six, Kate's Path, Cycle of Life, Night Magic, Crosswords, Letting Go. I feel like it's two of swords. Another one off the top, 29, Drawing Down the Moon, Divine Feminine, Source, Channel, Stillness. 29, reduced down to 11 angelic number you're honestly Kate's path and drawing down the moon this is about divine feminine energy you're going to need to really get in touch with that for healing i feel like it's for healing and we are to balance divine masculine and divine feminine within ourselves doesn't matter gender's not gender's not an issue here in order to heal though each of us get in touch with our divine feminine because we be, we have to receive healing. So divine feminine is receptive, divine masculine is giver. One off the bottom. 10, astral travels, possible, impossibility, freedom, traveler, inner dreams. So you've been dreaming a lot. You, I feel like you've been pulled certain places too. You have been. So hold on a second. I need, I need a light one up for this one. There's a story coming. I feel it. Dream Oracle card deck. I love. I love how the three decks work together. I'm glad it really got back in touch with the channel. Okay. Here we go. All right, two off the top, one off the bottom. Color, express your true feelings. I love it. You could be seeing colors, colors in your dreams. Now listen, if you see colors in your dreams, look up the spiritual significance of the color. Write down, keep a dream journal because there's a reason why you're seeing them. There's message there. Chase, face and embrace the person in the mirror. Now if this is runner chaser situation and twin flame connection, you have to chase yourself. The reason the runners run is because they can't face themselves. They run away from themselves. The chasers know how to chase down themselves. They know how to face themselves. That's who they chase. That's how they connect. One off the bottom, music. Sing the song of your soul and dance to your unique rhythm. Your medicine is coming through song, through music. Okay, let's go to the Crow Tarot. Um, there's healing here, but there's a connection here. 
not seeing that like the connections are wet. Like this feels like you're healing something. One more shuffle. All right, here we go. Five and five, page of wands, 10 of cups, two of pentacles, temperance energy, God damn. ace of cups, <laughs> the world. That's just like that little video. What is it, little boy? Oh, fucking damn it. Love it. The sun, the moon, wow. Chariot, seven of wands. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, listen to me. There are couples in the tarot deck, okay? The magician, the high priestess is a couple. That's a spiritual couple. That's um, evenly matched in spiritual gifts, okay? You got king and queen of wands. You got king and queen of swords. You got king and queen of pentacles. You got the king and queen of cups. You got the emperor and empress. It's also a match, okay? Now, the other match that you have that's a couple is right here, the sun and the moon. Sun is divine masculine, the moon is divine feminine. This is a couple. This is a twin flame couple. That's also an indication to me of a twin flame connection because it's divine masculine, divine feminine, where both of them dance together. This is the most beautiful read I've ever given. Like I said, I've never had a read like this before. This is amazing. Okay, listen. You've done the healing work and you, the two of you are connecting with one another, okay? This is going to start out as a message. It's going to be a message. Sweet, short, to the point. That's going to bloom into open this door to this family reunion type of situation. If you're in separation mode, it's coming to an end. It's coming to an end. The door has been opened. I had that dream the other night. And I've been saying this for a while, that those that are waiting in the hallway, waiting for this door to open, that door is going to open. When that door opens, those that are waiting, that have been patient in the waiting, are going to be doubly blessed. And what, when that door opens, it's just going to open wide. This is what's happening here. It's going to start out with a message and it's going to open up this connection here, like this family reunion type of situation, two of pentacles where it's, and it could go either way. Like there's, and it could be adding family to it, adding social circle to it, but I don't even feel like it could go either way. I feel like it's back with that infinity symbol that these two gravitate back to each other. That's what that is. Just be patient. And I feel like you've had patience and you've been waiting with that cup of love to give to them, to give them the world. This is coming back together. Divine masculine, divine feminine, the sun and moon, light and shadow. The sun illuminates everything. The sun gives light to the moon. Both of you, I feel like had to go and recalibrate your connection maybe recalibrate your lights and then come back together to form that dance the way it's meant to be fast movement because the blocks have been removed this it, all the decks have been cleared this is fast movement back together you know two of you have been speaking to each other through music through colors through dreams like this is reconnection let's go to the hidden truth oracle card deck One more shuffle. Okay, here we go. Two off the top, one off the bottom. I'm afraid to contact you. So many things remind me of you. And one off the bottom. 
and becoming a better person. Absolutely. I feel like this connection is coming to an end quickly, or this not connection is coming to an end, the separation is coming to an end, the connection is coming back together. And it could be a connection that they have with another person that's coming to an end. Like it's that type of thing. But this connection, like you can't stop this connection. I'm hearing something strange. Anyway, for the collective sign of Taurus, this is your quick little love read, love and light. 